Hey, what's up? It's Danny here from blackbeltentrepreneur.com. And in today's video, I want to share with you how I use Zapier to automate my business. Okay, so if you haven't heard of Zapier before, it's a really awesome tool that you can use to help automate certain tasks in your day to day operations. So, you know, breaking it down a little bit more, it's a way for you to take Maybe you have an application that you, uh, like Gmail for instance, uh, and there's specific emails in Gmail that you would uh, want your team to know if you have someone uh, that you have a virtual assistant or, or someone else that's helping you with work. Uh, maybe as, a, as an FYI, maybe you get monthly uh, newsletter updates for particular softwares or tools that you use, and it only comes to your email. Well, what you can do is you can send a rule, create a rule to filter out that email and send it to say a Slack channel if you use Slack for team communication. Okay, so that's just one example. Uh, but really the, the power in Zapier is just, you know, taking two different tools that are completely different, they do not share a, a similar database and uh, automate those tasks so that you have a holistic view and a streamlined workflow so that you don't have to manually spend the time to copy data over to do certain things like that uh, because although it doesn't take a whole lot of time up front um, it still does take some time and, and that time adds up so i'm going to show you from a high level how i use zapier for automating my content workflow okay so what i mean by that is uh, i create videos just like the one you're listening to right now and uh, what it allows me to do is automate some of the tasks that are involved in publishing that content. So uh, let me go ahead and, and click on the zaps here. So in, in my account, you see there are zaps and it shows you all the ones that you've created, uh, all the ones that are on and all the ones that are off. So uh, right now I currently have a free plan. Uh, I have five zaps, so that's the, the limit that you can use in the, the free plan. And if you click on that, you can click up on your account after you create an account. Uh, you can get some information as far as you know the, the amount of tasks that have ran in your month, uh, and then the number of zaps that you have. So I've maxed out all my zaps for my free plan, <clears throat> and then there's up to 150 tasks that I can run in a month under the free plan. So still, if you're using it correctly, you can get a lot out of a free plan. So uh, how I do it? Well, how I do it is I create a video. I create a video on uh, ScreenFlow, so I'm using ScreenFlow right now. And after I create that video, I'm gonna do a little bit of touch up, a little bit of editing, and then get it over to, to YouTube. And ScreenFlow is great because I can export the video directly to YouTube. And once it's processed and uploaded, uh, it, it can do a bunch of different things. And so what I have here, the first thing it's gonna do is it's going to uh, send a task to MeisterTask. For video repurposing. So what that means is I'm going to click on Meister Task. This is the task management tool that I use for uh, creating content and doing anything in my business. It's going to create a card in this ready column under my content schedule. And what that what that does is uh, yesterday I, I did a, a video for a 30 day content creation challenge. All right. So uh, what it does is it automatically takes the URL for the video and some information that I, I want included in this task card, and it automatically assigns it to my team so that they already know exactly what they need to do. It's a very powerful stuff, guys. It saves you a ton of time. Trust me, if you're trying to do more higher volume and scale up your content creation workflow, this is gold, okay? Uh, so that's one thing. The other thing is, you know, once I, once I have an automated task created, I'm also, going to, at the same time, get an order out to Rev for a transcription. So if you don't know what Rev is, Rev is just a service for transcribing video, audio into text so that you can repurpose and use that content and use that content in a way that you can supplement the video and embed it in your blog. Okay, very powerful stuff. Not everybody can watch video. Sometimes people at work, sometimes people are in a setting where they want to read or they prefer reading. And so that offers them that opportunity to do that. Not only that, it offers great SEO as well if you if you do it right. Okay. So that's those are the, the number one things that happen as soon as I publish a video. Okay. The next thing that happens is 
Uh, where is it here? Okay, uh, completed orders. So when my rev transcript is completed, I want my virtual assistant to know. And so I have it, the orders from rev go right to a Slack channel that tags my virtual assistant to let her know, hey, this is ready for pickup. And now what you need to do is you need to take that and you need to go and put it into my uh, blogging platform. I, I use the Rainmaker platform. You can use WordPress. Um, there's lots of different things. It really doesn't matter what you use. Uh, this is just how I do it. And so far, it's been really powerful. I, hey guys, I'm a busy, I'm a busy dude, and you know, and you, you're you're probably just as busy with your own life. Uh, you want to automate as much of it as you possibly can. And so this this stuff has been really great. Um, I've really been able to ramp up my content planning and my content creation, and not worry about all of the other stuff that has to happen in order for content to get published to my blog. Okay, so really powerful stuff. I'm actually going to be using it for for podcasting as well. So a lot of content repurposing uh, coming in the beginning of this year, uh, and I'm really excited. So if you haven't checked out uh, Zapier, you can go ahead to zapier.com and you can set up a free account and start playing around with it. There's just so many different opportunities to automate different things, uh, and you know just go ahead and check it out and play around with it. So I hope you like this video, and if you if you do, go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Uh, I have a lot more content coming down the way for different tools, tips, and strategies to help take your uh, digital business to the next level. And also, ch don't don't forget to check out the website blackbeltentrepreneur.com. Uh, you can go ahead and get free access to the Business Automation Academy uh, if you click on the Get Free Access. You can be taken to the landing page. We were just signed for a free account. You get ac exclusive access to the content library uh, that's already created. I have a bunch of stuff up there already to help you understand what a lifestyle business is, um, how to get the market, discover the market that you'll enjoy business building your business around, as well as some of the top tools that I use for productivity, tools that I use with my team, and just some other great stuff as well. So I look forward to seeing you there and take care.